Oh, hi! Oh, hi! This is my friend Brendan. Hello! And today, we're making this! Puppet. Puppet. Classy ladies. Here's what you need. Ping pong balls. Bow fur. Belt. <laughs> Tape. Hot glue. Scissors and pins. <laughs> ah! Cardboard. Foam. Pliers and a blade. Matching thread and a sewing machine. Polyfill. We have the pattern. So it's this piece. Trace that over the back of the fur. Flip the fur over. The nap is the way the fur is moving, so the fur should all be flowing down in that direction. And then you flip that over and mirror it, and you trace that on the back. And we have this piece, which is the belly of the puppet, and you trace this on the back of the fur with a fur flowing towards the bottom, and you mirror that. If you mirror it directly, this seam, you can cut yourself out some sewing and then cut out that whole piece. And here's that top piece, traced it out on the back with a fur flowing towards the bottom, flipped it over, Traced it out with the fur flowing towards the bottom. You can get awesome patterns like this on projectpuppet.com. All right, here we go. We have all those pieces that we cut out. The middle piece, the side pieces, and the top piece. Because we flipped this over and cut that whole thing out, that left us with just one piece here for the middle. So what we're going to do first is stitch this part together right there. When we're done with that, we'll stitch in this middle part right into that. And when we're done with that, this seam gets stitched to this seam. So it kind of will look like that. And then all we're missing is this piece over here, which is the top of the head, will end up covering over that. So right here, this thing right here is going to be the mouth. This is the top of the head, this is the face and the back and the belly. We're going to pin it and stitch it. Alright, so mine's all assembled, mostly, and still inside out. Terrifying. Brendan tells me I need to take felt piece that I cut out around the mouthpiece pattern. You need to sew it right sides together to the hole you have at the top. So the mouth plate, I'm going to explain to you how I made it real quick. Uh, you take that piece of cardboard and that mouth plate pattern, it's just a little oval with a line, and you cut that out. Then what we did was we separated those two pieces, the bottom and top, just about a pencil's width. We added a piece of tape on one side and a piece of tape on the other side, and I made a little gaff tape hinge. Then we covered the whole thing with tape and added a little hard piece of foam right there for you to grip on. And there it is, the mouth plate. <laughs> so then what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna put hot glue all over the top and the bottom. Your puppet's inside out, you stitched in the black felt and we're gonna glue it in right into the black felt. And that's how you glue in your mouth plate. It's so scary. <laughs> so now I turn it inside out. Evolving, evolving, <laughs> evolving. Hey! Looks like a fucking puppet! It <laughs> <laughs> does not look too bad! Now we're going to make the eyes. Take your ping pong ball and cut it in half. And you take your foam and you glue it into that half a ping pong ball just like that. Cut some of the fur down so you can glue the eyes right onto the fabric and you're gonna hot glue them wherever you want them. So the eyes have happened and we put little felt pupils on but if you have extra felt from the mouth bit you can just glue with that shit on. Now we're gonna put on the notes! She's so cute! <laughs> and that is how you make a puppet. Done clomping around over there. <laughs> I'm clomping. Hey, could you please shut your mouth? I'm um, recording. <laughs> come here, come here. Ignore them. <laughs> don't, don't listen to them. <laughs> don't even listen to them. 